G'day folks. I thought I'd just share a bit of information about spirit guides with you and how to hear them. Now the easiest way to do this is to make sure that you don't have too much uh, noise in the background or too much too too busy in your head. And an example of this could be simply uh, try and get out of the get out of the wind a little bit. An example of this could be you know, if you're standing in the lounge room of your house and you've got the TV on and you're talking on the phone and there's two radio stations going in the background and it's too much and you can't hear any of it. And it's very similar and the same type of thing when you're trying to listen to your spirit guides or when they're, when they're trying to communicate with you. So it's important that you uh, spend some quiet time with none of this stuff and uh, it makes it easier to hear. Sometimes, if they have very important information, they can get through and be heard over the top of all this, but uh, that's only, as I said, only in, emer in an emergency. Uh, now, spirit guides too, that their job is always only to help you, to benefit you. So anything you, you get from them, it's not there to scare you, it's not there to frighten you, it's not there to lead you in the wrong direction, it's always there to help you, to help steer you in the right direction for your life, so you can be the best you can be, so you can benefit the most and, and learn the most. Yeah, so it's nothing to be afraid of. Usually too, when you think to yourself, when you get an idea out of nowhere, quite often too, this idea is not yours. This is not an idea that you had. It's an idea that is given to you from an outside source. So don't be too quick to dismiss your gut feeling or your first thought or your first impression. Because a lot of times, after you get a thought from somewhere, you then think about it, you rationalise it, and you don't follow through with what don't follow through for whatever reason. So it's um, it's important to think or to remember that maybe your first impression or your first idea, maybe it's worth uh, following up on or pursuing a little bit. Because as I said, quite often it's not an idea you had, it's an idea that was given to you, and always for the for always for your benefit. So I think that's all I need to share today. Yeah, that's about it. So don't, don't be too afraid to uh, spend some time in the quiet with no, distra no, dis no distractions, because this is the best way to, uh, to get this information wherever it comes from. See you soon. Well, there you go, a little bit of information to share with you. If you've got any thoughts or suggestions, stick them in the comment section below because I'd love to have a read. You can also hit the subscribe button because all the time I'm sticking up videos uh, of one type or another. You can also check out my website which is www.billgray.com.au. Hope you have a good day.